Next stop, Chiang Mai. So I arrived in Chiang Mai last night and I've got two nights here to explore. So my first place in the north of Thailand. I'm just hanging out with a friend today that I went on the boat party with in Co PP. Um, we didn't realize we'd been this, we're in the same place at the same time and the same hostel again. So it's just been fun to see her. Um, we're just hanging out today, exploring Chiang Mai. So far, it's a lot more relaxed than the south of Thailand. It's kind of nice, kind of refreshing, to be honest. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna see what's around in Chiang Mai today. Going in a little tucked up tour. Are you excited? <laughs> First stop on our tuk tuk tour. This is um, one of the oldest temples in Chiang Mai. It's pretty cool. There's some really gorgeous temples around. They're all pretty much walking distance from where we're staying, which is pretty amazing. They said this one was called the Good Luck Temple. That's really pretty. Some people emptying buckets of fish into the river, and we didn't know why. But basically, we found out that it's like a tradition, and you can empty these into the river and let them go free. And it's like for good luck. I just want to rescue them all, to be honest, and put them in the sea. It's kind of strange. First, I didn't know the reason, but I was kind of like, yeah. <laughs> if the animal is surviving and going back into the wild, then I'm all for it. So. Here we go. I've got a little turtle to empty.
I don't know what it is, it's like sweet corn or something. Not sweet corn, but crunchy corn. Oh, it's a mango. Let's get a full bite. <laughs> Just about to get the bus to Pai from Chiang Mai and I've heard many things about this bus that apparently the hills are so windy that it's like it feels like the bus is gonna fall over. And I've just seen on the ticket you're recommended to take um, motion sickness tablets because the hills are that bad so I'm excited for this adventure. See you on the other side. <laughs> 